All right. A beautiful day, a perfect morning it is. This very Sunday as we prepare to have a look at the matches available today. It is my pleasure to welcome you to the Must Better Betting Tips YouTube channel. If it is your very first time coming across the channel, please ensure you are subscribing, turning on notifications because we are going to be winning and when I talk about winning, I mean we are going to make massive profit out of sports. Every single day when I go through the analysis, when I try make these predictions, my sole purpose is always to deliver winning selections. And I'm always glad when we are able to achieve that very massive goal. So to get us rolling, I will remind you about the video that is coming up. Yesterday I hinted on the role of a betting strategy. And I talked about the strategy indicating that we will be having it later sometime next week because you need the rollover strategy. You need a rollover betting strategy, especially for three odds and 1.5 odds as we head into the rest of the year. We're coming to the end of the year and you're all aware that we need to make something out of sports. So with the strategy, I believe it's going to be super massive. Now, talking about yesterday's results, of course, Finally, we were able to break the cars. And when I talk about breaking the cars, yesterday was super amazing. 99% of the predictions that were shared yesterday were able to fully win. So that is so much incredible. We had 4.15 odds winning. You know, they are juicy odds that allow you to make profit. And I'm so glad that it won. Of course, it was a risky selection because we went for Ukraine winning corners. One very market that I tend to always ignore, and the other two corners were solid, so it was a cash. It, it was a, an amazing, amazing, perfect bet. And then the other game that won, we had 5.348 odds winning yesterday. Congratulations to those of you who were able to stake on the match. Now, this one was for the UEFA Nations League matches. We had England winning, we had Greek winning, Greece, whatever. The, okay. So, guys, that is it. The other game was 2.518 odds winning, so. It also consisted of, a, consisted of a double chance, a re exam win, and the final selection was also there. And finally, we had 3.506 odds winning, which was also a perfect, lucrative win. I do love the both teams to score option, you know. It provided so much juice and quantity and weight to this very fourth bet slip, and it resulted into a massive massive cash out so congratulations to all of you who were able to win with us yesterday with these results i'm so glad that everyone was in a position to actually win yesterday and when we talk about subscribing to the channel i believe this is reason enough for you to fully subscribe because i did a lot i did a lot and uh the best you can do this very morning is to show appreciation by liking the video, by sharing the video to your WhatsApp status, WhatsApp groups, Telegram groups, Instagram channels, you know, anywhere you exist as a sports better, as a gambler, please go ahead and share this very video because today there are limited matches, so we're going to keep it simple. There are three bet slips, 2.37 odds, and there's also a corner selection consisting of a value bet and one additional corner bet slip. And there is a second bed slip too. So guys, get ready. We are about to roll. Do not forget, it is important to subscribe to Must Better on YouTube because you will be receiving daily football predictions and betting tips that are thoroughly analyzed. And when we share them, when I share them, I expect us to always be able to win. So bed slip number one, we have 2.37 odds. We have Slovakia playing as Abby Jane, right? From UEFA Nations League, we are betting on Slovakia win the game. The odd is 1.431. That is the first game in this video. And then the second game in the very first bet slip is a game from Iceland. Okay, you know, pronunciation is an issue. And yeah, I hope you guys do understand. We have the home team playing the away team. It's clearly written. And we are betting on the home team to win. The odd for the home team winning is 1.24. Okay, and then we have Tor Akureyri, uh, Akureyri versus Dalvik from Iceland. We are betting on Tor Akureyri win. The odd is 1.232. An amazing selection. And finally, 
we travel to the women league hamabi women playing christian sons women that is from sweden alves can women competition hamabi women to be in a position to win this game the odd is 1.24 if you do not love the women options because i know women you know the last time we had an amazing selection and i included some women game you know it never ended well so if you're not interested in backing this beautiful women today then you can ignore them and remove it from your very bad sleep yeah you know swedish women are so much perfect i only see them online when i'm googling instagram right and then we have bad sleep 2.3 odds portugal playing scotland that is our second bad sleep now it has a summation of 2.3 odds and the very first game is portugal coming up against scotland we are betting on portugal win the game the odd is 1.253 it plays under uefa nations league okay and then we have a game from iceland one dailed reik javi kur playing grota we are betting on the option of reik javi could win the odd is 1.41 iceland one dailed as i've said And the final game in the second bet slip is Denmark playing Serbia over 1.5 goals. The odd is 1.35 odds. UEFA Nations League, all right? Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now finally it is time to go through the corner bet slip section, but before I share you the matches available in the corner bet slip section, please ensure that you have liked the video, subscribe to the Must Better Betting Tips YouTube channel, you have turned on notifications. And you're very much ready to have a look at the value bet that I have prepared for you today. I know you're potentially thinking much better. Today Portugal is playing and you always talk so highly of Portugal when it comes to the corner market. Is the Portugal game the value bet? Nope. Nope. We don't have corner. We we are not betting on the Portugal game today actually, so I'm so much sorry. We have Luxembourg playing Belarus over 8.5 corners the odd is 1.75 Nation League. Now, it is a value bet at the same time it is also risky. It is also a risky value bet. You know there are safe value bets and then there are risky value bets that require one to have some amazing, you know, very turgid rigid balls of steel. So Luxembourg Belarus over 8.5 corners. Yeah, I, I love it and the reason I love it and the reason I prefer it over the other corner matches available today is because it comes with an amazing juice 1.75 odds. Finally, we have the last corner game today. Joel Nir, okay? Yeah, playing after Relding, after Relding from Iceland one dailed. Fallner, right? We're going to assume that J is silent. Fallner playing after Relding. Iceland one dailed over 9.5 corners or the odd is 1.610. So that is the second corner game. If you are to combine these two games, that is 1.61 multiplied by 1.75. Do the maths and you will get the odds that it contains. However, do not forget the value bet when I share it and indicate it as a green. You know, I always have them in a green background because I want you to understand that they stand out and i perceive them differently so the value bet is supposed to be staked on single and even if you're still going to combine them do not forget to view the value bet as a single bet that provides you better opportunity and a higher cash out probability guys we have officially come to the end of today's video as you know it is important to join us inside telegram i will be leaving the link to our telegram channel in the pinned comment section i will be sharing the link in the video description click on the link join us inside telegram because i do believe today we're going to be having further selections if not further selections then later in the night i will share one late kick off corner game inside our telegram channel so purpose to join purpose to attend and i wish you the very best this sunday enjoy your weekend let us meet tomorrow monday with perfect beautiful interesting wonderful news Bye bye the service is officially adjourned